Partly historic and partly futuristic, I would say. Huh? Historic, because uh, the idea of a so-called uh, stepper repeater uh, came from their predecessor uh, Philips or Philips Research and so. Huh? A set of Philips working on a lot of things, they focused. And there is this book out, huh, Focus, by uh, uh, Mark Heinke the other day, which is worthwhile reading. All these sh uh, shells in this ecosystem of, uh, of uh, suppliers and uh, multidisciplinary uh, 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 production plants, that sort of thing. Huh? So the, uh, well, call it the second and the third shell of uh, reliable and uh, uh, very expert uh, uh, companies are also uh, very important. And that in our Brainport Brabant is unique, uh, even on a European scale, I would say. Uh, my well, the company that I worked for for quite a few decades, Philips, was one of the front runner, uh, earliest uh, investors in uh, in Taiwan. Uh, uh, in fact, they also co-founded uh, TSMC, which is now by far the number one. But it is a nice example that captains of industries uh, on both sides uh, should come together and create a momentum again which was so vast and, and successful in those days. Could we have, well, call it a Marshall Plan or so, huh? so money and the will on both sides uh, to, and long term, uh, longer than 10 years, uh, well, a few times uh, 10 years I would say, if you do that and make it possible on industry level, institute level, and university levels, eh? exchange programs, that's to me the, the formula. It's not a new formula, it's just reinventing. We are familiar, of course, with photonic communication through glass fiber networks that uh, exist and that have re replaced copper-based, uh, well, electronic transport of, uh, uh, well, uh, uh, data and, and information. So it is a great potential because the driving forces are, uh, I would say, data transmission or storage rates, but also energy uh, re uh, consumption reduction. Today's uh, uh, internet use, for example, uh, in take an example, uh, America takes six percent already now of the entire energy consumption, and is projected to be many tens of percents, uh, well, within uh, one or two decades. So, so there's a limit. Is uh, it, my st statement is that uh, silicon and all the other semiconductors will still uh, stay. To be there and I also am sure that it will certainly take a growing market uh, share for the reasons I just mentioned.